So here we are. We have made it to day nine. And first of all, today we're gonna start off with just some standard crunches. So you need to get down on the ground, like I so. And all we're gonna do is just simply raise our shoulders slightly up off of the ground and then back down. Things to note, please be sure to keep shoulders back. I don't wanna see any rounding with the um, elbows coming up around the head, cupping your head. And also you need to be sure to keep your uh, airway passage open by keeping that chin up. So here we go, we're gonna go for 10 of these. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, inhale down, six, exhale up, inhale down, seven, eight, nine, ten, being sure that you breathe that way through the crunches will help to get the most out of your work. So if you need, you can get up against a wall to do your push-ups or we can do push-ups from the knees would be a more intermediate level or push-ups from plank. So here we go. We're gonna go for, let's see, eight of these. So here we go. One, two, three, be sure you're Keeping that spine neutral, that neck doesn't need to be tucked. Five, six, seven, eight. Whew. All right, I'm gonna grab a quick drink and we're gonna be going to our squats next. So we're gonna do squat with pulse. So what I need you to do, keep those feet about shoulder distance apart and we're gonna squat pulse. That's one, two, three, four, five. Squeeze those glutes. Six, keep that core engaged. Seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Very well executed. Our tricep depths are gonna be next. So go ahead, get your chair. If you're using one of those, don't forget that you can do it with bent knees like this. It's gonna be a little bit easier and if you come out to plank style, that's gonna add a little level of difficulty. So we're gonna go for eight of these. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Keep those shoulders back. Five, try to keep shoulder blades drawn towards each other. Six, Seven, eight. Okay, last but not least, we're gonna sit in our chair for this one. And I want you to get kind of at the edge of your chair so that, you know, just your sit bone and a little bit of your, um, the top of your thigh is gonna be at the chair. And then hold your arms up by your head and we're going to alternate lifting right and left elbow, uh, or right knee, left elbow together, and then reverse that and do the other side. So we're gonna go for 10 of these. So it's gonna be one and two and three. And you don't have to touch elbow to knee the main thing is that we're lifting as high as we're able, keeping our back straight. We don't wanna hunch over toward that knee. Four and five and six and seven 
and eight and nine last one and ten and ah, very well done so go ahead and we'll grab a drink and then we're going to go to crunches once more okay we'll have 10 crunches again so go ahead and lay back on your back remember keep shoulders back and airway open by holding the chin up here we go exhale up one inhale down exhale up inhale down exhale up inhale down four and five and six and seven and eight and nine and ten and ah beautiful so back to our push-ups we've got to do eight push-ups so here we go you get in whatever position you need, if it's against the wall or, or off of uh, your knees, but we're going to do eight. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Excellent job. The next thing that we're going to go to is our squat with pulse. So we're doing 15 of these. Let's go. One, remember feet are shoulder distance apart. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Excellent. Okay, to our tricep dip. Here we go. We're going to go for eight of these. So, ready and one two three four five six seven eight and then two are alternate knee ups so keep those shoulders back elbows straight and out here we go one and two and try to keep that back straight three just lift that knee as high as you can and four and five and six and seven and eight and nine and ten okay the next thing we're gonna do after we get a quick drink of water we're gonna go back to our push-ups this is our last round. You are doing fantastic. We are pressing right along in this um, challenge and I'm so thankful for it. So here we go, let's get our push-ups done. Let's get up against that wall or on the knees or plank, whatever you're doing. Here we go. One, two, three, four, Keep that core engaged. Five, six, 
seven, last one, eight. Whew, I can tell I'm getting stronger in my chest because when we started this, those push-ups were looking pretty awful for me. So we're gonna go with our squat, with our pulse. Here we go, ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. It is such a beautiful day to be outside. I just love springtime. I love the sunshine. I love hearing the birds sing. It makes me hopeful, you know? And to wake up and be hopeful is really a gift. And I'm so thankful for that. Uh, you know, you can look around in your life and you can take on the mindset of, you know, this is the day that the Lord has made, truly. like. Everything that I come across, every person whose path that I'm in, um, I have the chance to make a different and a difference uh, in a better way towards their life. Like I can, I can either add to their life or I can take away from it. I can either be value or I can devalue. And I want to do that with myself, and I want to do that with others. And I hope, um, you know, in this challenge if you take nothing else away from it you take away some value in the fact that uh, you are finally um, putting your health above um, your want to uh, take rest or to um, you know be um, in a state of what's what am I looking for? What's the word I'm looking for? I think sometimes in life, we want to escape. We want things to be easy. Um, and we miss the mark whenever we're doing that because um, the things that are worth doing or being or becoming, they take strength. Um, they take willpower, but they truly are worth it. And I hope that you find that your time has been worth it with what you've done with this so far. And I hope that you continue to feel that way the farther you go into this challenge. Um, I hope that you take away more than just physical health from this. I hope that you have a change of mind I hope that your heart is transformed a little bit. Uh, I hope that Christ will use me um, to speak to you in some way. Okay, so onto the tricep dips because <laughs> I've kind of got a little winded there, but um, hope you enjoyed that break. Here we go. Remember, you can go from knee bent or plank style. Here we go. One, two, three, four, push those elbows straight back, six, seven, last one, eight, and now to our alternating knee ups with our elbow touching the knee, so here we go, hands behind the head, and one, and raise that knee up as high as you can, two, and three and four and five and six and seven and eight and nine and last one ten don't forget the end <laughs> and
and that's the end of it day nine thank you so much for joining thank you for continuing this journey with me um uh, i love you and i hope you are enjoying it we'll see you tomorrow <laughs>